Okay, this is a quick video about the 7 inch TFT LCD color monitor I bought from um, DB Electrical. It's supposed to be for a tractor. Nobody seems to know what tractor it's for. And um, it was difficult to get. Um, well, I couldn't find a connector for it. So this is what the connectors look like. Um, if I hold it under the light, you can see it has a, a, a polarizing pin right there and four pins connecting to it. There's a yellow one, there's a black one. They're, they're this, both the same apparently, except that the black one is AB2. The yellow one is AB1. So I'm giving the monitor 12 volts on the red and um, ground on the black from its connector. That's this guy. All right. And then um, these two AB connectors like that, they come from this guy, which parts it. But I don't have anything that fits this one with any precision either. So just have to use that the way it is and do something with the other one. And um, I have it uh, connected to the output of a DVD player. And then um, it's, it's playing an old movie. So uh, can't show you too much of that, I think, because of copyright, especially during a strike. Um, it has this AV1, AV2 selector. If I switch it to the one with no connection, it just tells me no signal, and it says that's AB1. And then um, there's a green wire coming out of the multi-wire connector. That's this guy. If I put that on 12 volts, you'll see what happens here. It switches to the other, to uh, it switches to backup camera mode. Okay, I'll just do it again while we're watching was on AV1, now it's on backup camera. So AV2 is the backup camera. And um, on the pinout, I just numbered them this way, looking at the connector, I gave it uh, one, two, three, four, all right? Uh, number one is uh, voltage source, presumably for the camera that's coming through at 10 and a half about so I'm giving the whole system 10 and a half, roughly. Two and three, I haven't figured out quite yet, but uh, they're probably sound left and right. They, they didn't do anything for me with the connector, the sound connector for the DVD player. And then number four is the video signal. And um, I, don't, I don't think the uh, outside shell has anything on it, but you would probably want to avoid contact with it anyway. So... Um, that's the story. Um, good luck.